what's up guys welcome back to the freaking channel welcome back to another freaking video oh yeah this video is finna be freaking amazing okay we got some glizzies we got some glizzies okay the oscar myers original beef so today y'all we're gonna be glizzy fishing for some catfish baby so we got we got the uh old ugly stick we got the old ugly stick pole with us today. We got the camera all set it up on the stand and everything. And nice and purdy. But let's talk about the glizzies, man. Catfish or bottom feeders, as most of y'all probably know it, they love some glizzies. They love some gizzards. They love some chicken liver. They, they love anything they can put their mouths on, okay? But y'all, today we got the glizzies. Let's go freaking catch some catfish with some glizzies, okay? Some freaking hot dogs, baby. But look, y'all, we're at a local park. The pond's just right over it. It's not that one, but it's right over there. We're gonna walk over there. I'll see y'all when we get set up and uh, start casting some lines, okay? What's up, guys? We out here, baby. Grab the stand to show you a little bit. We are, we're out here. We're at the pond. We got the glizzies, okay? We got my fishing pole. We gonna, we gonna set everything up. Have it stick down somewhere right here, and then, uh, we gonna wait till something big hits it, okay? So y'all can see me. We got the. Uh, we gonna tear one out, baby. This is for the catfish. I don't know why I'm eating it. We got the winnies. I thought I almost forgot one important thing. My knife. So we gonna get it. We gonna cut up little, little inch sections, just about about that big. So y'all can see that right there. So, we got our hot dogs. Now, let's test the waters. We're going to put the small one on there first. We're going to test the waters, see if we can't get anything biting right now. Now, the trick is how to uh, rig a hot dog weenie. Go through the skin, okay? And then you're going to come back right back out. Just like that, have that barb showing. Freaking perfect. I'll start her out there, man. Oh, all right. Dude, I ain't I ain't washed this freaking rod in a minute. You hear that? That's like that's the drag, bro. Hopefully, whatever bites it can help the drag for me, but as of right now, we're gonna let it loose. It's kinda all rusted down, got rocks, dust, and everything on it, man. It's been in the back of my truck for a minute. So what rig I actually got set up is, literally, I have a bullet weight with a little six inch leader, and then I got my octopus hook. So I got that all set up, man. We're just gonna let it sit out here and uh, see what we can catch. Something's bound to freaking hit this dude. What'd I say? What'd I say? Tighten the drag. Tighten the drag, baby. What'd I say? What'd I say? What'd I say? Let's fix y'all. Let's fix y'all real quick. Freaking fat so right here, boy. Freaking fat so right here, dog. Right here, I'm croaking. <laughs> Hell right, dude. Got the hook out. Freaking, let's go, baby. We're going we gonna to get a couple pictures with him and uh, gonna give this boy, bad boy a quick release. He's, he's wanting to go. Freaking perfect swim off right there. Dude, let's catch us a freaking other one, bro. All right, we got a nice perfect release on that fish. So like I said, the little, I got a little like six inch, whatever, a little later right here, my octopus hook, and then I got my little bullet weight. 
got a little bobber stopper right there. I don't know if y'all can see that. But it helps it, you know, not put as much stress on the leader and the string. And then your line tied to your leader. Don't put enough stress on it. So let's put on another hot dog and uh, see if we don't try to catch us another one, baby. All right, guys. We got we got the whole setup kind of situated now, so we're gonna, we're gonna see if anything hits. Let's go, baby. Let's freaking go, baby. Number two down. It's a freaking nice little croaker. Alright, let's put this bad boy back. Freaking, that's some good eating right there, boys and girls. Oh, almost fell in. That's okay. I'm gonna just literally sit right here. Almost just fell in for this bad boy to release him, but here you go, boy. Don't, you better not splash me, I swear. Oh, you did it anyway. I was wanting to put his tail underwater before he did that, but hell with it. Good release. Yo, this is getting way too much fun, okay? We gonna go one more, baby. One more. We gotta try to catch the Mac Daddy of catfish, okay? All right, guys, we got her set up. Now we got to wait. All right, we didn't catch nothing on that cast. Uh, kind of waited a little too long than expected. I'm really anxious to throw in a new spot, so. Uh, Now we wait, see how long we wait on this one. All right guys, Oscar Meyer is definitely doing the job on some of these catfish, but look, we got our little last weenie dog All right, guys, let's take a quick break since we do have to wait for the ride and for the fish to get on the bait. But look, y'all go check out America Freaking Fetcher at AmericaFetcher.com. Rahel, baby, go use code TAYLOR, all caps, for 15% off, okay? We got some really nice stuff and a lot of new stuff that just dropped, so y'all go check them out. Let's get back to freaking fishing.
Let's see if we can't. I'm still waiting. Let's see if we can't get nothing off this rod, man. Let's freaking go, baby. Let's go. Number three. Number three. This is a big one. This was a decent, decent one. This, this is a decent one. Yo! Yo, this is one of the biggest ones on the here, bro. He came off the hook. As soon as I got him on the bank, he came off the hook. Now there's a leaf attached to it. Yo, yo, this is one of the bigger ones of today for sure. For freaking sure. A little longer than the other one, a little thicker, but yo, let's freaking go, baby. Let's get a, let's get a good release on this fish. Let's take a couple pictures and then, uh, Hell right. Freaking go, baby, let's go. All right, guys, I picked y'all up. We walking just right, literally right there. Got my stuff set up. As you can tell, we got the old Oscar Myers, baby. Oh, picked myself out a weenie while I threw it, but hey, slide that back up in there. And then, bam, have y'all seeing the whole view as I stand up because I want to give y'all the best experience possible that that is my that is my goal okay just like that we gonna stick her up in there just like that and let's uh let's freaking, freaking catch another freaking catfish baby let's go No! No! I literally just snapped off. So, that camera view, y'all couldn't see it. So, the line started running. I picked it up. As soon as I picked it up, the line wasn't moving again. And then it started going. So I was like, all right, bet. I grabbed it. When I walked back with it, I pulled it up, started reeling, and it just snapped completely from the line dude it's freaking it's great man and i honestly think that was a big old catfish that that was a big old catfish the way he hit it and the way i felt it on the rod bro and y'all saw me y'all see me i started running over my rod dude that's what i that's what i started seeing the line going started going i was like shoot Man, that, that, that's just tragic. That, that's just tragic. All right, so here's what I'm going to do. We're going to go back to the truck. We're going to get some things so we can, uh, you know, fix this right here. Throw it back out because I want to catch one more catfish before we do go. Okay, I want to catch one more. Dude, I had to pass that dog park and bro. Like you hear some squirrels in the tree barking. You got a couple of them birds up there. But uh, there she blows my old 
My old Chevy. Oh yeah. There she blows, baby. Oh yeah. So let's uh, let's uh, open her up and see what we got. See, I don't have an extra liter. I know that for a fact, but I will say this. And I quote, have hooks and stuff. Daggum. Oh, we might actually find one. We can actually probably use maybe one of them, but you know, we'll just use what we got. But we got a little hook. Now, hopefully this will work. I mean, I'm, it's not the ideal hook to use while catfishing or anything like that, but we also got a little bullet weight. So uh, let's get back to the rod and the setup and try to catch this last catfish, bro. All right, we are currently back from the truck. We do have our weight. Right here, we're just going to slide it on. Then we're going to get our hooks set up as straight. Old daddy taught me this. Twist it around a few times, seven or more, and then you sense it up. And then cinch it up just like that, okay? And then we're ready to throw it out there, mate. Let's see if we can't get our last catfish. Now, if we, now let's just say if we if we keep catching these catfish, we gonna keep freaking fishing them, baby. Let's hope this last cast will produce a freaking pond giant. Okay. I just lost another fish. The only way that I could have lost another fish is because of this hook right here. I'm letting them eat it. And then as soon as I pulled up, it's like just yanking it out of their mouths, man. This hook ain't nothing. Well, guys, look. It's getting a little bit dark out here. Getting around dinner time, I'm kind of actually getting hungry. Should have kept one of those catfish to eat. From this hook, I can't even catch a dead gum catfish, bro. I lost two catfish with this hook. I need to get some more hooks, most definitely, because I'm all out of those hooks. I need to get some more. I need to get some leaders too, specifically for catfish, okay? Dang gum, dude. I wish y'all could have seen that, but my camera died. Uh, my phone's finna die, so it's like, it's, it's just not, it's just not, not a good ending to an efficient trip right now. But uh, y'all, I had a freaking amazing, I had a freaking blast, caught some freaking cat daddies. I hope y'all did enjoy this video. Make sure y'all leave a like on this video. And guys, make sure y'all go check out the rest of my channel, okay? We have fun over here. Make sure y'all subscribe. I love y'all. I'll see y'all on the next freaking video, baby. Noggin.